It's so good to see you. Good ladies. to see you again. How are you doing after Wednesday night? Oh my Still gosh. high? Yeah. Uh, natural high. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, let me correct you. Yeah. High on adrenaline and absolute joy after the premiere and now the Golden Globe nominations for Fantasia and Danielle Brooks. Taraji P. Henson also stars and completes this trio of outstanding performances in the musical adaptation of The Color Purple, Out Christmas Day. What do you do? Time for you to see the world. But shockingly, the studio wasn't so sure the talented trio could pull it off. We all had to go and audition, and I'm, you know, I'm like, I'm Academy Award nominated, what you mean? But I had to check my ego. <laughs> we all had to check yeah. our ego. Thank God that we did. It was a six month process that I am so grateful for. Once cameras rolled, these ladies became thick as thieves. A true sisterhood was born. How come you so nice? I don't know. What was the process like being on the set? between the three of you, these three black women who are loving each other into being. We had a lot of fun. We did. We had a lot of fun. We had a lot of heavy moments too, mm -hmm. but we were there to hold each other up. We had some hiccups. People kept catching COVID. We tired. We didn't think we was going <laughs> to yeah. cry. I'm gonna hold my head up. I'm gonna put my shoulders back. But Late to night. see it the other night, I, I don't know if y'all felt that way, but it was almost like that's we had to go through. Mm. Oh, this yeah. yeah. Yeah, you know, birthing a baby mm -hmm. is not easy, it's painful. And to prevent the newly nominated Fantasia and Danielle from making some of the same mistakes she made, Taraji stepped up like a big sister should. You got to stand up. Thanks for the gems you dropped. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. My what kind of gems <laughs> did she drop? Oh, a lot. She a be lot telling us to go get that money, honey. Yeah. <laughs> Telling that, like, you know, what not to do. They're talented, so I'm, I'm not really, I wasn't really concerned about what they were doing on the set. For yeah. me, it was about contracts, yeah. what your people are doing. Yeah. Don't make the same mistakes yeah. I made. You know, so I was more interested in giving them those gems, because they, the talent they got. But you always have been so good about that, about yeah. making sure you get what you need to get. Yeah. That's, and fighting know, for it. We, we all we got. Yeah. I mean, you talking about a world that turns its back on us every chance they get. So if we don't lift each other up and hold each other responsible and love on each other, who will? I told you Fantasia, I saw you do it when you did it in 2008 or 2009. And this time, Celie was different. Yes. She was different than she was before. Yes, and, yeah. and I felt that all the way. Um, back then it was, I was younger. I had a lot going on in my world. So I felt like I was carrying my cross, her cross. That was an overload. Um, I didn't get to really enjoy it. Now I'm older, I'm wiser, I'm married. I see things totally different. And so I wanted I wanted Seely to see some things different as well. I didn't want that same experience. Mm -hmm. um, and I had fun doing so. I'm glad you said that because they, I had seen the play, but it was long ago. <laughs> you know, a lot of things have happened. But, um, <laughs> When they showed a clip of the original of you on, like this work in here, baby, I, you know how you get the your skin yeah. raised up right here? It's transformative. Yes. It's transformative, sweetheart. Like, I didn't see this, like you said, I was like, whoa, this is two different situations Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's so rare that artists get chances to do yeah. that. Yes. You know I, mean? I know you were able to talk to the original Sophia and Oprah, mm -hmm. and you were able to meet Margaret. Have you talked to Whoopi? I got to finally talk to Whoopi yeah. at the view, yeah. and that was good. It was good. She yeah. finally said, I, if anybody was going to do it, I would have wanted it to be you. So I said, thank you. And what did, what did Margaret say to you? When she saw it, she, I, she made me cry, because she came down to the stage, and she was like, tell Raji, you just, and I was like, and we all just thank them for laying the groundwork yeah, because, yeah. you know, they were they were the originals. I know you said when you needed Oprah, she picked up. I did reach out and say, hey, can we have a conversation about the character? She generously talked to me for about almost two hours, and we talked about the character and talked about her journey, and she shared things with me. Um, and I just was like, thank you, God, because now I feel like she's really gonna allow me to take this journey for myself too mm -hmm. and like trust me she trusts me with this precious character that she's made so iconic well ladies i just want to congratulate you on your first classic 
Oh, because Miss Thane from the gate. I just want to congratulate you on your first Thank class, you. and it will be one of many. Thanks, and I sweet. couldn't imagine going through this with anybody else. Same. This has really been just, okay, no, he's too I early know. to cry. <laughs> but yeah, I have to say be this. It, this really has been an amazing experience. Mm. Yeah. In the same. Yeah. In the same. And thank you for that because you truly have been doing this for a long time in mm -hmm. classics. Baby Boy from, was one of your first movies, yeah, I believe. Yeah. And like mm -hmm. to be continuously doing that and have the longevity that you've had is also, not, everybody doesn't have that. Yeah. So it's pretty amazing. Now it's all good. <laughs>